What is it? <laughs> what is it? Take this. right there. Who's gonna catch it then? Show it, really show it. Why you throw a t-shirt over it? Throw a t-shirt over it, that'll stop it. Leave it. Leave it, it's gonna take somebody's head off. Wow. You get it? She's gone. <laughs>
good evening, whatever time you're uh, checking this out. It's um, what time is it here? Five to three on Monday morning, and we're just about to get on the bus to uh, to Tenerife for a few days warm weather training. Always a good trip when you get away with the boys to a warm weather camp. Um, obviously, the priority when we're away for the next week or so is to uh, get as much training in as possible on the field in uh, in a decent climate and also there's some benefits with that where the boys get to get a bit of sun on the back spend a bit of time together for even more bonding uh, so it's something we're, we're really looking forward to not a morning person but uh, you know like I said it is, a, it is something for the boys to look forward to so looking forward to that we'll get some uh, We'll get some more vlogging done for you while we're away. Uh, I just want to touch on the game from Leeds at the weekend. First and foremost, thank you to all you guys that travelled over. Uh, outstanding away support as usual. Wouldn't expect any different uh, from you people, so thank you very much for uh, making that trip over to, to support the boys. Uh, just a quick summary regards the game. It's hard for me to be ever be critical to any of my me, me teammates, um, so I'm certainly not going to... Uh, certainly not going to do that, uh, but I think it would be fair to say, um, and I'm sure all the boys and, and the coaching staff would agree with this, we're probably a little bit off in terms of um, ball security, execution and things like that, compared to the previous week at Hull FC where I thought we looked um, outstanding, particularly with ball in hand, I thought we were a little bit off at Leeds and that probably cost us, cost us quite dearly really, um, but I don't think it's a lack of attitude or effort I think that is there in abundance so we've, we've got a group of people that definitely want to work hard and I think what also brings that out of people is the fact that we've got some real real strength in depth this year so that's going to keep people working extremely hard doing all the small things working hard for the team and it's going to keep everybody on the toes so uh, I don't think we're ever going to see a lack of attitude and effort this year uh, that's one thing we can bank on going into pretty much every game I'm sure of you want to get sat down mate yeah and let's have a look at your attire come around there I want to see I want to see what you're wearing are they the knockoff trainers you got? Oh, that's real good. Huh? Real good fakes. <laughs> I'm a real man. Officer, I got one question for you. Oh, what are those? What are those? Hello, folks. Ben Kane here. In replacement of the real Ben Kane just asleep. Today we've got a uh, George Lawler. Hello. That's us all in uh, Tenerife, ready for a uh, bit of pre-season training. So I just want to say thank you again for watching the vlog. And um, we really appreciate your support. And like I said before, for any additional uh, club news, exclusive interviews and match highlights, you can find all that at hullkr.tv. Um, this will be the last vlog until we get back from Tenerife, so we'll let the media department do their work while they're here and we'll put some stuff together over the course of this week, ready for when we get back. So, uh, catch you all next week guys, and again, thanks again, really appreciate you supporting these vlogs.